What is going on, my good people? This is your man, and I'm thinking we chilling here with Rocco. Rocco, say something to the good people. Wow, wow, wow. Hey, so check this out, right? Just came back from well, in a tent at KO, and I had a a I don't know, a new guy, a rookie. I don't know what you want to call this guy, a a, a, a rogue rampage maniac. <laughs> it's right to skydive directly into the compound all right so this is something that some of you guys may not know about ko first things first ain't you gonna say something What's to me up? that shit down at the airport sounded fun appreciate you bro hey so um first things first about ko there is two air defense systems so <laughs> if you want to skydive if you're halo jumping into the island you certainly cannot just skydive over to the compound because Ding, ding, ding. What well, he had to do say, bing bong. You got to disable the air defense system, which is located on the ground. So, yeah, that's not going to work. You, you got to hit the ground first. So what, when you hit the ground and see if you could just do like a, you know, when a Fortnite jumps back up to the sky and dive back down, maybe. No, it, it's just not going to work out like that. When you're skydiving in, get to the edge of the island, out of sight, because you can get spotted while you're still in the air skydiving. So that's why I went to the edge of the island. The guys that I was with, this dude got his body blown up. How do you get your body blown up by air defense systems? You might ask. By thinking that you can skydive right into the compound. Like, this, it does not work that way. Sorry. Um, yeah, so, yeah, yeah. Do not try to skydive into the compound. Oh, I guess Dr. Dre's not in the studio. Oh, I can't go back here. I thought I couldn't go back. Um, yeah. So do not try to air, do not try to skydive into the compound. That's number one. Number two, which should actually be number one on the list, is always follow your heist host, right? Because see, like me, what I do when I go in there, um, I it depends on what I got in the vault. If it's like some, if it's one point one, if it's nine hundred thousand, if I have two paint paintings in the office, if it's two paintings in the office, then typically I'll just use the sub and just go straight for the vault. You know, but if it's no paintings in the office and it's like 1.1 or 1 million in the vault, then I'm going to hit up the island. So if I'm going to hit up the island, typically I skydive or I'll use the long fin. But lately I've been skydiving, right? So if I'm skydiving, if I'm used doing a halo jump, I'm jumping towards the edge of the island, right? And my first objective, and this is the reason why I use the skydive method when I'm uh, going to hit up the islands. Because first I go in and I look for the coke. So even if I trigger the alarms when I go in, I'm just fighting and trying to survive as long as I can to find where all the coke is at. Once I know where all the coke is located, right? It's two back, two you know, you two you know, two things of coke. You know, you fill up your bag twice. You know what I mean? And that's the four point. That, well, not four point, but it's you know, four hundred thousand and sixty nine, right? So I'm gonna go ahead and do that. I'm gonna grab all the coke. I'm gonna know where that's at. And then I'm gonna look for the truck. I'm gonna look for the cargo truck. When I find where I know where the cargo truck is at, I know where all the coke is at because I'm hitting up the island. That's when I'll go ahead and start grabbing people to do the heist. So if you're doing it, you know, for guys like me, we already know where everything is at. You know what I'm saying? We're going to dive right to where we need to be. Follow your heist host. Especially if the guy's got a mic and he's telling you, follow me. I know where everything is at. And you no, I'm going to go ahead and just uh, I'm going to free fall into this missile. <laughs> See how how well that works. <laughs> it's not going to work out. Right. When they start firing off at you, it's going to alert them to everybody and the heist is over, basically. So, yeah, that's that's my advice, man. The biggest tip, you know, is, is just honestly follow your heist host. Right. Whatever he's doing. Some people take some more extreme methods of prepping for the heist. You know what I'm saying? Some people take some extra steps like me to know where everything is at on the island. So we can just boom, boom, get to it and get out. You know what I'm saying? That's what I like to do. So um, with all of that said, man, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. This is just a little, I mean, PSA, yeah, right? For KO, a little tip for some of you new guys coming into the game. Yeah, follow your heist host. You know, don't piss off Rocco like y'all did last time. And the same question I would ask to that guy, his name was Alexander something. My friend, how? How did it feel getting your body blown up by an air defense system? Like, literally, your body, not a plane, not a plane, but your body, like that. Yes, you have to be. Were you shocked? You probably was shocked. I wish I was recording. All I saw was, listen, I was on the ground and all I saw was pew, pew. 
and boom, just why, why? Yeah, don't do that, man. Don't try to skydive into the compound. It don't work. <laughs> well, at least you know now. Thanks for watching. This is your man to the potato. You watch it, RC Omega. And yeah, we out here. Rocco, say something to the good people. He about to go here and make some tracks. We out of here. Peace.